Hello everyone, welcome to Joe and Zach Survival. I'm just out here checking the burdock plants. We've got a ton of it on the property here. And uh, come July here, it'll be time to start picking the roots on those, digging them up and getting those ready. And, and I like to dehydrate them or fry them into burdock chips is my favorite. But uh, one thing that we don't do is the second year plant, and I have one over here, and you can tell the, the first year plant is just a rosette like you saw, but the second year plant comes up and it, it gets a stalk and then eventually it flowers and, and it gets the, I call them sticker burrs that stick in your hair and stick on your clothes and everything like that. But as that grows, it disintegrates the root so it's no longer edible. But the stalks on the, even the rosettes and, and these here are edible. They're like a celery and I want to give them a try. The flower stalk that you can see coming up right here it comes all the way up and eventually that'll get a flower. Um, that is edible and we're going to peel that. So let's uh, give it, uh, you know, peel it and see what that tastes like because I have never tried this. As I look around here we've got stinging nettle. I've, there's a ton of it down here. I've already harvested a lot this year but not from this patch. I've got a lot of it here. Oh, we've got dandelions and we've got over here We've got plantain. There's just so much to eat in the wild that people just do not realize. Anyway, let's get back to that burdock plant and see if it tastes like celery or what exactly it's going to taste like. see if you peel this down it actually kind of looks like celery it's a real light green underneath there the whole plant is edible none of this would be poisonous anyway but all right let's give it a try It doesn't taste like celery. You think it's going to be bitter, but it's really not. It gets a little tougher as you go down, and it gets a little bit more bitter. Let's try one of these young leaf stems and see what that's like. That's not bad. The leaf stem is a bit more bitter. Still edible, but wouldn't be my favorite. And that was a young one. Maybe boiled it would be good. The flower stock, I like that. That was pretty good, but it's still not as good as thistle. <laughs> anyway, there you go. You can go out and pick your burdock flower stocks right now and eat them like celery. I bet you they'd be really good boiled. Thanks a lot for watching the Jones Act Survival Channel.